Hey loves, it's your girl April coming at you with another video. I know it's been a minute. So let's just talk about some things. Let's play catch up. When I went to Mexico and I was working on the orange knit sweater, I don't know what I was doing wrong. I had got quite a bit of uh, ways through the pattern and it just wasn't coming out right. So I decided to frog it and when I develop the patience, I'm going to try my hand at it again because it's an absolutely beautiful poncho and I really want to make it. I think that I know where I went wrong with the pattern. Unfortunately, it's not like a video or, or anything or, or email or something that I can email somebody and say, hey, I need a little bit of clarity. So I'm going to try it again. And if it still doesn't come out right, then I'm going to go to my local yarn store. So I love the yarn that I was using for it. The pattern is not that it's written bad. I just think that I didn't have my stitch markers in the right place and I didn't have enough stitch markers in place to know when to switch because with that pattern, it appears that you have to switch back and forth between the Brio stitch and then it's another, uh, I guess, stocking that stitch that you're, that you're doing with it. So I'm gonna try this again when I develop a little bit more patience. Right now, I've really just been more so on my crochet thing. I think it's because it's just quicker, but I did do another project that involved some knitting and I love the way that came out and we'll, we'll do another video where we're just talking about that because I wanna do a video just talking about beginners knitting, beginners crochet and I decided that I also want to do a little bit of amigurumi. Stop. My dogs are just sitting here wanting to play. As soon as I do a video, all this time they weren't playing, now they want to play. Needless to say, I decided I want to do some amigurumi. And I want to do amigurumi dolls. I've played around with some other amigurumi stuff this week. And it's been, it's been pretty interesting. But I recently ordered this book right here so this is called my pretty brown doll and i love the way the book is it's it's a nice um nice material on the book and these are just absolutely lovely i saw the book on amazon and i kind of just bypassed it and i was like oh, all right I'm, I'm gonna save it for later and then I saw a lady on Facebook. She was doing a whole different project, but she had this book laying next to her. And I asked her how the book was, and she was like, the, the pattern is very well written. I love how my dolls came out, and I decided to order it. So this is like one of the pictures that's in here. This is another um, pattern that's in this book, and this is talking about just the base. So this is another reason why I ordered the book. I went to Joanne's and I had got a book and the book really wasn't a doll. It was, it was kind of like a doll, but it didn't have the legs. And I wanted something that is going to give me the how-to of the base. So if I want to do other clothing designs and stuff like that, I can actually do it. Frank wants to be a part of the video. Hi, Frank. If you're not going to say hi, I don't see why you're popping in the camera. I don't know. Maybe he's a little camera shy. Oh, he just wants to be in my face. Oh, okay. Oh, uh, okay. He decided he wanted to leave the video. No problem. So these are a few pictures that's inside of the book. We're showing you how to assemble it after you do a base or in the process of doing the base. I love it. It shows you how to do the hair. I am so, I'm truly excited. I'm truly excited. I think that I'm going to dive into this book next week. And here's another photo from the book where you can see your, this is where you're assembling the hair. So yeah, All right. mm, look at this, look at this. It's just adorable. I'm excited. I'm excited. I'm going to get into it. Okay, I'm going to get into it. They show you how to make the little accessories, the hat, the jacket. This is this is absolutely lovely. So I stopped in, 
just to tell y'all that I'm going to do some of Mega Rumi. And I'm going to continue working on this halter top that I'm doing because I made these shorts right here. This is just freehand shorts. I saw a photo of some shorts similar and I decided I wanted to make these make these shorts. So I made the shorts and I'm nine times out of 10 gonna give them to my daughter cause I made them in her size. But that was it y'all. Love, love, love you to life. Love, peace and many, many blessings. I will catch you in the next video.